This is the a kit cabinet, 35 by 35 by 35 centimeters. Now we will unbox and then do the assembly. Once done, this is how it will look. There are totally five panels, four side panels and one rear, which is kept in the center. The first step shows the four side panels. As shown in the picture, two panels have projections called wedge dowels that clicks into the pre-drilled holes or grooves of the other two panels. It has been arranged as shown in the manual. You can see in the picture that uh, one panel is numbered one. In these two panels, the bottom is uh, marked the number one, the groove of which is deeper compared to the other panel. Firstly, we join the panel marked one with the adjacent panel. The wedge towel clicks into the groove. Similarly, the other uh, plank is uh, fixed on the first plank. Uh, you just need to gently hit with your hand or use a plastic mallet. Step 4 is uh, fixing the back panel which uh, involves sliding it through the grooves. Step 5 is fixing the fourth side panel. You can use a mallet here for fixing firmly. Sixth step is uh, now you can slide the back panel into the groove of the opposite panel so that it sits firmly. The seventh step is fixing the plastic locking buttons on the center of all the four sides. These buttons are used to lock the back panel to the four side panel so that it doesn't move. We have four pairs of these locking buttons. First fit the outside button and then the inside one. Similarly, fix on all the sides. Now, this completes the assembly of the ekit cabinet. The assembled ekit cabinet is ready and looks like this so now that the kit cabinet is ready we have to fix it on the wall you have two options either fix it on the ground for which you get legs or you can fix it on the wall for which you have to use this suspension rail this is the kit suspension rail so this is a rail these are the left and right brackets and a few buttons the first step is fitting the allen screw on the bracket. It should be fixed from the top partially and not fitted fully. After fixing the screw on one bracket, do the same on the other one. In the second step, the two brackets uh, have to be fixed on the rear panel of the kit cabinet. Now fix the plastic uh, push fasteners on the two edges of the bracket. 
first fix the plastic screws the plastic pin should click into the plastic screw similarly on the other bracket it is tricky to fit the plastic pin into the screw for uh, fixing the suspension rail on the wall we have to make markings for which we use this paper template the paper template has two markings so we keep this against the wall mark it and then drill at two points Now that we have fixed both the rails, we will uh, fix the two ekit cabinets. So now the first one is fixed. Similarly, we have fixed the second ekit cabinet also above the first one. You can also have arrangement like this. You can arrange a kit in whichever way you want. We already have an arrangement like this in our bedroom. One more thing you can note that uh, you can fix a wooden uh, door on the kit cabinet or also we can fix uh, glass doors.